Hello. I decided to um, make a, an English blog this time because the, the last time was uh, in Swedish when I was unpacking Zelda the Skyward Sword and a bunch of other stuff. Um, so basically I'm sitting here in my bed, bed, in my bed. I'm hardly able to speak because I'm so tired um, still. I slept for like 11 hours last night and I've done absolutely nothing today and that's okay <laughs> because I slept for like 10 hours between uh, Thursday morning and Sunday night. Um, and the reason for that, that uh, is because I was at uh, DreamHack in yarn shopping and it was really fun and really exhausting and I couldn't find any time to sleep. Uh, main reason for this is that I entered a programming competition that Computech was having. Uh, didn't plan to but my friend said that he thought I should uh, join so I instantly thought, yeah, I should do that. That, that would be fun. I've never done that before. So I, ent I entered and then I realized I have no idea how to um, behave myself in, in one of these competitions. And uh, I mean, how do they expect me to, to write the code so that they like it and everything? Uh, I just basically tried to make a lot of comments as I usually do, actually, because I can't keep anything in my head. I need to write everything down, and I find it easiest to just write comments so that I can easily just go into the code later on and see what I was doing <laughs> and um, keep doing it. So I, yeah, and and they they actually announced that. Uh, one of the criteria would be uh, they would uh, uh, look at how how many uh, calculations the computer was uh, had to do um, in order to decide who made the best code. And so I, I thought about that in the, the first uh, step of the competition, and I made decent code, I guess, because I got in the finale. And the thing about this competition is that they announced the the, um, the questions or the thing you were supposed to do at 8 in the evening and then you had to turn it in before 8 in the morning. So you can imagine that I didn't sleep <laughs> at night. And in the morning, so I, I, I finished the... Uh, I finished them about... Um, yes, sometime in the morning, about three or something. <laughs> uh, last step, I finished at half past four in the morning, and then I just slept on my keyboard basically. Uh, but I moved the keyboard away, so I put my jacket on the on the desk and just slept like this. Um, that's perfectly doable if you are so tired you don't know what your name is <laughs> and I didn't have the energy to, to walk to the place where you should supposed to sleep um, and they have these silly rules on DreamHack uh, that you can't sleep under the table because that would be a fire hazard if there was a fire they would not find you and you would die and you can't sleep on several chairs, even if your uh, mate isn't there, because, I don't know, maybe that's a fire hazard too. <laughs> or you're not supposed to. Simple as that. Um, anyways, so since I got in the finals, I had to do this for two nights. And so I did. <laughs> And then when it, when the morning comes, you have slept like two hours at your desk. Uh, you're just like, yeah, I'm just going to go check on this thing over there. Uh, there's a tournament going on, and and there's uh, exhibitions, 
uh, what is called a lot of companies uh, showing their stuff off and you can buy things you can win things you can play games and you can watch people playing games you can uh, sit at a computer cl playing games um, you can of course if you had like to program some more maybe read up on what you're supposed to know <laughs> but I didn't do that um, and then uh, yeah I didn't win but that I got into final was pretty amazing actually uh, considering uh, how how little I have spent programming in C uh, and C++ uh, which I choose to use for this competition. I usually nowadays I do a lot a lot a lot of stuff in um, PHP and MySQL and that sort of stuff but um, it's pr pretty different way of thinking um, when you do that. So I've been <laughs> I've been looking into that and not optimizing code in Z. <laughs> so that I got into the final wa was, um, yeah, I didn't believe it at first. <laughs> so, but then of course I got very disappointed with when I didn't win, even though I knew I really couldn't, especially after hearing about my friend's uh, solution. He, d he actually did win uh, and he was so worth it. Uh, he, he said stuff I didn't even began to comprehend and uh, some other stuff I only began to comprehend and I was like wow that's really smart uh, I need to learn how to do that I think I got his code I, I'm gonna watch uh, I'm gonna look at it sometime when my brain works and I have time mm, uh, maybe next year um, anyways um, yeah, so we did all that, and it was my other friends, uh, sorry, the, the friend that won the competition was uh, Snilled. I didn't even know he was going to be there, but it was a fun surprise that it was. Uh, and then my friend that I went with, uh, Pal, it was his first time at DreamHack, and he absolutely loved it, and we've already decided we're going to go this summer too. So that's fun. I've finally found someone that to go with, and um, my other friend LG is probably co coming too because he was one of the. Uh, he, he he was he was there with a company that had a. Is it called exhibition? That's the only word I can think of right now. It is called something else. Sorry. <laughs> so. Anyways, and then of course Emil, which is pretty much um, a veteran going to DreamHack and going to places, being a nerd and yeah, being social. <laughs> yeah. So oh, and we uh, I I was going there, being like, I think I want to play something like uh, Dota because uh, I'm not so sure how to pronounce that in. In English but yeah so because I really enjoyed doing that last time but I don't remember how to get my illegal copy of it going I have uh, Warcraft 3 uh, but uh, the installation of, of Dota is something else on my computer so um, and totally illegal so I shouldn't use it right um, but I I got to DreamHack and noticed oh there are several clones of Dota so uh, that are free to play so we'll try the, one of those so basically we just tried the first one that we came across uh, League of Leg Legends uh, it's uh, it felt like a cartoonier version of uh, the the original game and uh, the map felt smaller and the, the battles seemed shorter and the building seemed uh, no n didn't seem it was very much simpler so I kind of like that and yeah decided that this is fun let's try this for a while and then <laughs> we then I went around asking, okay, but what about this Hon thing, uh, Heroes of New Earth? 
is is that good too? And everyone was telling me, yeah, the pl the ones playing uh, LOL is probably thinking that is, they're, they're saying that is better and more people are playing that. And the pl people playing Han is saying uh, that this is better and uh, more are playing that. So um, I didn't know what to think. Uh, but after watching a, a tournament of Han, I, I decided that it's probably more complex. And you probably get more credit for um, for being good at that, but I have so little time, so I've decided that I'm going to to be a player of the simpler game. <laughs> and uh, we have already started out our characters and uh, oh, sorry, summoners. And uh, yeah, so. And my friends liked it too, so so yeah, <laughs> we got stuck in that swamp. Um, right, uh, what else? Yeah, the laser show uh, was amazing this year too. Uh, nothing new, I think. It was just still amazing. Um, I always get amazed by the laser show at Remac. Um, yeah, and then there was this song that everyone li really liked. It's called Bacon. It goes Bacon, 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 <laughs> basically. Uh, just uh, search for uh, Dreamhack Bacon. You find it. It's a beatboxing guy who made it. It's really good. Um, and it's really silly, and there's a lot of silliness at Dreamhack. The last night I was like, I was so tired, I didn't know where, what my name was. I went around, uh, met this friend fr from uh, the pirate party, and I think he was a little drunk. <laughs> and, but I don't know wh which of us was the craziest. We ended up going around asking everyone if uh, there was a panda on their head, and when they said uh, no, <laughs> we were like, right! And then I just shouted fish at them and ran away. Um, I think maybe some people got confused about that. I'm pretty confused about that, <laughs> but it was a lot of fun. Um, and then, of course, I missed the raid to the Stato, um uh, gas station because I thought it was the, in the beginning of the, the lawn and it's actually in the end. Um, so I missed it again. I think it's a tradition that I miss it. So, because I've never done it. And then the Dreamhack train started. That's basically a lot of people running uh, in a big train, running around. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I, I saw them when I was going to, to get some sleep before driving for five hours to get home. <laughs> that was pretty, pretty crazy. Well, it was like uh, two in the morning when I decided that I'm going to go to the sleeping hall to, to get some sleep before I drive home because we're going to gonna go at 10 a.m. and my friend is gonna pack my computer up so I don't have to worry about that I'll get a good night's sleep okay so but then I didn't find my stuff and uh, well it was a bunch of problems um, and then I finally got to sleep around 3 I think or something like that and then, but it was the, still time to sleep, okay? And then, but by 7.30, the crew came and wake us up. They woke us up. They showed me real hard because they already turned the lights on and start, uh, started to play music at top level, um, full, vo full volume. Uh, and uh, I didn't wake. <laughs> I didn't woke up. I was like asleep <laughs> in a big way so they have to shake me and tell me you have to go up and I was like yes and started to go up and then I w looked at, at my mobile to see what time it was and what like what 7.30 why am I going up at 7.30 we don't have to be outside until 10 a.m. my friend is going to do everything for me <sighs> um Nothing to do. They would probably they couldn't know that. They were probably afraid that people if people were 
still sleeping at 10, 10 a.m. when we had to be outside, we wouldn't be outside. Um, nothing weird about that, actually. So I just had to help my friend get everything out and uh, get a car around to, to pack our stuff in it. And it was then that I, <laughs> I met my friend from before. Oh, I got a message. Uh, yeah, I met a friend that I met a uh, former boyfriend, uh, it was his friend, and uh, yeah, we've been at Dreamhack before. I kicked his ass in CS <laughs> once. Uh, I basically think because it, it was an uh, assault, uh, and uh, I had sound and he didn't, uh, and my aim was not off, and so I won. But uh, still won, <laughs> and it was his choice not to, to look for for headphones before before starting the game, and he chose the the map too. So hmm, could have chosen like dust or something that I totally suck at. <laughs> Anyways, this ramble has gone on for far too long, and I don't know what I'm saying, and I have to. Um, I don't know what I have to do. Probably have to eat again or something. Um, sleep more. Um, and everything. I'm returning the car to my dad tonight. So, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, if you want to meet me in person, go to DreamHack Summer uh, 2012. Because I will be there. I've decided. So.